Hi Gemini, welcome back to Omkara Tarot and to your last love bite of the year. This time we're going to do it a bit different gems. Uh, I'm going to be asking a question this time. Since the new year is right on us now, I want to know how your person feels about you. What they're feeling, what they're thinking, what they're planning, what their thoughts are about this connection at the onset of this beautiful new year. Okay, so let's begin. Welcome back all my subscribers. Welcome in newcomers. All right. Uh-huh. Gemini. Oh, they want to apologize for something. Let's see. Page of Cups, center of the spread. And be mindful. Uh, energies can be flipped sometimes, okay? Uh, three of Wands in reverse. I think they want to... They're worried that you've turned your back on them. I think this person wants to apologize. They want to end some kind of argument or fight and so that peace can be restored. They do want to open up. They do want to clear the air. They want to talk. They know that you can. You are the one who makes the, all their dreams and wishes come true. Uh, they're wondering how to end whatever happened, whatever ending happened. This person is manifesting. They're manifesting big time from a stagnant place at the moment but let's see okay so let's start with your dialogue message cards let's see if your person could say something to you what that would be and then we'll clarify these cards so gemini's person spirit if they could say something to each other uh, to them what would that be gemini's person what would they like to say gemini's person spirit what would they like to say to gemini a few more gems from another deck Gemini's person spirit. Gemini's person. All right. Okay, gems, let's start your reading. And I, like I said, be mindful. It could go vice versa. It could be flipped. Deep in my heart, I know you're the one for me. I promise my soul will be by your side for all eternity. I struggle with revealing my true feelings and emotions. When I miss you, I don't have to go far. I just have to look within my heart and soul because that's where you are. I was misguided. I was blinded. I could not see straight. Life seems so complicated for us. My mind often drifts to thoughts about us escaping reality to somewhere really quiet where we can be alone. I believe the best is yet to come. Keep praying, stay positive and keep believing in us. That's what they are doing. They're manifesting, they're dreaming, they're wishing and they want you to do the same. Judgment. I'm making a decision once and for all to turn this around. My heart breaks a little bit more every day that we are apart. Okay, so this person doesn't want to be apart anymore, it seems. Uh, Gems, let's, uh, let's see. I'm going to take your angel blessing card first and then we'll jump right into the reading. So, my angels, what do you have for my Gemini gang now? Blessing, guidance, advice or a message healing say somebody wants to heal this connection and praying maybe to the angels to send healing and healing is possible it's available and this connection i think does have the potential of getting healed if you wish it so the angels are ready to send you healing so spirit how does gemini's person feel about them what's the six of uh, swords what's the six of swords they want to heal, see, same card, healing. They want to heal the, bro the heartbreak that has happened between the two of you. They want to end this conflict, this fight, or whatever argument, or whatever has happened between the two of you, so you guys can uh, be happy and peaceful once again. Yeah, they don't like the stagnancy that's come into this connection, Gemini. This person wants to heal whatever's broken between the two of you. In fact, they want to open up. They don't want to hold back any longer and uh, say, hey, can we start again? I'm, I'm ready if you are. Let's just open up. Let's not hold back from each other. 
yeah but they that they, they are a bit afraid they are a bit afraid to be the first ones i guess they do are seeking clarity see ace of swords ace of swords this person really wants to have clarity they're not happy without with this uh, no talking or lack of communication this person is itching to talk they're very very emotional at this time and they're not really feeling very happy with whatever's happened between the two of you they want their happiness back and they know that the only way they can be happy is uh, with you because you are the one who can make all their dreams and wishes come true they 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 this person wants to take action they want to answer your questions they know you probably have a lot of questions for them now and uh, they're anticipating them uh, so they could be preparing i don't know they could be preparing wondering um, how to open up after whatever petty behavior has happened how do i take action they fear that you're going to be very cold towards them or maybe you have your boundaries up now they are planning i think of um saying something which is like an apology but they is, they do want to come back and take responsibility this person wants to take responsibility they want to show back up as an emperor they want this past baggage to be dropped they are tired of overthinking stressing having sleepless nights they do want to give that love offer but they're going back and forth in their mind why spirit why the two of pentacles what are they thinking Okay, one more. They feel, they feel okay. So they feel that you're very guarded at the moment. They feel they are wondering where, why you're so guarded. Uh, they know that you're very attractive, that you are a go-getter. You turn heads wherever you go, and they're kind of little worried that the reason that you're not uh, talking to them now is it because there's somebody else who you've committed to. is there another commitment that you're in that thought really makes this person feel devastated they feel devastated by the fact that uh, the reason for your not now talking to them is because you've moved on with somebody who's very stable and good to you ten of swords in reverse ten of swords in reverse yes they somewhere they feel uh, they made the wrong choice or the the i don't know this person could have had a third party they made the wrong choice they're quite devastated with their own lack of choosing but heart of hearts they all they want is a revival now they want a second chance they want a revival this person is in heavy manifestation mode as a magician so what are you manifesting tell me what you manifesting regarding that your person oh my god they manifesting that they can have a ten of pentacles with you that they can have a happily ever after with you that they can come back and you know heal this connection and have a long lasting connection with you this person is heavily manifesting give me one more yeah because they feel without you then none of their dreams and wishes will ever come true and this person could be feeling very lonely they could be feeling lonely and sad and feeling unhappy they are right now manifesting that if only i can get my get you back well that would mean everything to them this hanged man why are they stuck spirit what's the hanged man Oh, they're stuck only for one reason and one reason only because they feel either that they've lost out on your love, right? Uh, they uh, kind of feel that uh, a bit lacking hope, I guess, because of their past behavior. This person has a lot of embarrassment and shame. They feel that I had an opportunity to have this ten of cups in the past, but I never invested. right so now they feel uh, what if uh, you don't love them anymore and what if uh, you know i've lost out on an opportunity and even if i do want to go and talk to them what are the chances that my hope and wish will come true because uh, they feel knocked down from their pedestal a little embarrassment and shame is keeping them stuck nothing else also because they feel that maybe now you've turned your back on them uh three of wands overall energy yeah they feel you've turned your back now you have totally emotionally walked away from this connection 
you've kind of accepted that there was no emotional happiness i got no offer i got no love offer i got no apology and that you don't love them anymore and have left them behind uh, emotionally disconnected from them and turned your back and walked off uh you got out of this uh, feeling like an option with them or uh, sitting in a connection which was too confusing they feel you've already made up your mind and the fear is that now you've dumped that cup of love that you were so freely giving to them that you don't love them anymore that's how they're feeling so spirit tell me this new years around this new years any action from their end feeling their energy is very scattered they do see they do want to return yes they do want to return but their energy is so scattered at the moment because of the stagnancy this, they are in love they know this connection is special this is a two of cups connection they want you to be their empress to their emperor but somewhere i don't know why they feel that you won't want them back because of their immature behavior or their player ways there's a bit of fear that's about it i think this person does want to come back and heal this connection um it's just a matter of time i think they are trying to see things from your perspective their perspective and figuring out whether there is still a chance this person wants a revival of this connection that's for sure yeah they want to end the fight and they do are they desperate to talk let me put it this way All right so that's what i have for you gems till next time then love and light take care namaste